Hello everyone, welcome back to Cliff Tips. Today, we're going to talk about how to check website speed and best practices. We'll be using two popular tools, Lighthouse and PageSpeed Insights. So, let's dive right in. Why website speed is important. First, let's talk about why website speed matters. A fast-loading website improves user experience, reduces bounce rate, and positively impacts SEO. So, it's essential to regularly check and optimize your website speed. Free tools to use. Now, let's introduce the tools we'll be using today. Lighthouse is an open source, automated tool for improving the quality of web pages. It has audits for performance, accessibility, progressive web apps, SEO, and more. PageSpeed Insights, on the other hand, is a tool that indicates how well a web page performs on the Chrome UX report and suggests performance optimizations. Let's start with Lighthouse. You can run it in Chrome DevTools, on the above right-hand corner click the three dots, scroll down, under More Tools, click Developer Tools, Choose Lighthouse, then click Analyze Page Load, wait for a moment, and a detailed report will be generated. The performance score will give you an idea of your web page speed. But Lighthouse provides much more than just a score. It gives you detailed metrics about your site's performance. Let's talk about a few key ones. First, Contentful Paint, FCP. This measures the time from when the page starts loading to when any part of the page's content is rendered on the screen. For a good user experience, Lighthouse recommends an FCP under 2 seconds. Largest Contentful Paint, LCP This metric reports the render time of the largest image or text block visible within the viewport. A good LCP score is considered to be under 2.5 seconds. Cumulative Layout Shift, CLS This measures the sum total of all individual layout shift scores for every unexpected layout shift that occurs during the entire lifespan of the page. A good CLS score is less than 0.1. Time to Interactive, TTI This measures the time from when the page starts loading to when its main sub-resources have loaded and it is capable of reliably responding to user input quickly. A good TTI score is less than 3.8 seconds. Remember, these are just a few of the metrics Lighthouse provides. Always aim to improve these numbers to ensure a fast, smooth, and enjoyable user experience. Using PageSpeed Insights. Next, we have PageSpeed Insights. It's even simpler to use. Go to the PageSpeed Insights website, enter your URL, and hit Analyze, and it will begin to audit your website. Wait until it is done and you'll get a report for both mobile and desktop versions of your site, along with suggestions for improvement. Now that we know how to use these tools, let's talk about some best practices. Always aim for a score of 90 or above. Regularly check your website speed, especially after updates. And don't forget to optimize images, minify CSS, JavaScript, and HTML, and reduce redirects. That's it for today's video. Remember, a fast website makes for happy users. So, use these tools and best practices to keep your website speedy and efficient. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next one.